Prem would need play off for title with precise Liverpool and Man City results. Manchester City have one hand on the Premier League trophy after Liverpool dropped points at the weekend, but the title race isn't over yet. There's still just three points separating the top two sides with three games of the season left. And even if Jurgen Klopp's side can't triumph over Pep Guardiola's men, there is still the slim possibility they could force a playoff match. For that to happen City will need to first slip up and lose against either Wolves, West Ham or Aston Villa to allow Liverpool to draw level on points. Should their tally be the same come the end of the season on May 22, then goal difference will decide the victor. However, there's little between them in that respect too. City drew four goals ahead thanks to their 5-0 win over Newcastle on Sunday, May 8, but that gap could easily be closed. If it is, the next factor which comes into play is goals scored. With City currently on 89 and Liverpool having smashed an 87, the Reds just need to outscore their rivals by two goals in their final three games against Villa, Southampton, and Wolves. The Premier League brought in a rule in 2020 that if there was nothing to separate two sides in the table, then their head-to-head -head record would come into play. But as both of their games this season finished 2-2, that doesn't help the matter. So per the handbook, there is a genuine chance of a playoff match happening. The relevant rule reads, if two clubs cannot be separated by operation of Rule C17.1 and C17.2, a playoff on a neutral ground, the format, timing and venue of which will be determined by the board. Who would you back to win the playoff, and why? Let us know in the comments section. It would be a remarkable end to, yet another remarkable title fight between two of the best English teams of all time. The playoff would likely be held at Wembley and would no doubt spill over into June with Liverpool in the Champions League final on May 28. The Athletic report the Premier League board are yet to decide the regulations for any potential playoff final, so sharing the trophy could also be an option. But no football fan would want that in favour of the prospect of the winner-takes-all match.